Hey everybody, welcome back to Iron Harvest. We are still in the middle of the longest mission ever. And, uh, well, it feels like an endgame mission, but it is really just mission number three with Saxony. So, I'm not sure if I'm anticipating for more of that to come. Ah, here's the Eisenhans. <laughs> well, don't rush, guys. I mean, don't... Yeah, it's it's fine. Just take your time. Bum, ba, bum, ba, bum. I can even hear them uh, whistling a song there. Anyway... So, uh, yeah, I hope this isn't uh, this isn't a spoiler for the missions to come, because uh, I, I want to progress the story a little bit faster. But, uh, yeah, we're going to deal with it. Uh, of course. Ouch. Don't, don't, don't flame my engineers. I don't have roasted engineers. We're going to deal with it either way. Uh, let's go over yonder and, well, let's first kill this wave, and then we'll see... Get rid of you. Okay. Um, what? Where well, there's enemy units? Ah, here. Okay. okay, let's kill this group as well and uh, just take our sweet time. There's the second Bhutan coming. I mean, they're not gonna. Ah, there we go. That's what I like to see. So now we got our own imbalanced uh, long distance. Firepower? What's wrong? Why are you escaping me? Where are you going, guys? Okay. We don't chase this. We don't chase this. It's fine. Um, Eisenhand's gonna stay here. We're just gonna try and make a quick beeline for that thing here. Um, actually, engineers, I'm gonna put them in the pillbox here. And you guys just turn around like so. And we're gonna try and quickly take care of that other siege mech over there. Okay. Um, do we want some more... Ah, what the hell. Let's get another Eisenhaus unit. Why not? Okay, friends. And while we're at it, let's get another one of these... Like um, so. I mean, we have one more supply, so we might as well use it, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. The prince must have been a philosopher there in his other life. Okay, so we got all of them done. Now let's upgrade you. Oop. What now? We did it! Their artilleries have been destroyed! It will be a short-lived victory if we don't cut off their supplies. Show me their train station on the map. It's protected within this base, sir. I think we could take it. They've taken heavy losses, and we have the momentum now. But that's against our orders, my lord. Do you prefer to sit another six months and watch a whole generation of Saxonians march to their graves? No, sir. Then let's do something about it. I want that train station. If we can't destroy the fortress, we can at least cut it off from supplies and make them come to us. New primary objective received. Uh, sure. Building upgrade complete. All right, so let's get these guys out of here. And uh, maybe, actually, I'm gonna. We have this squad here. Let's actually bring them up and decap a couple of these mines. Uh, well, actually, some resources here, some resources there, and yeah. Can you please? Thank you. There we go. Okay. Very good, that's what we like to see. Nice. Okay, these Eisenhardt soldiers are really good. Now, the Saxony faction apparently is very, very strong in defense. A bit clunky in offense, but... Oop, where did you come from? Okay, um, let's pick up some flamethrowers. Did I bring these guys here? Did I misclick? I think I did. 
Um, there must be a second Eisenhand squad somewhere on the map marching up there, no? There they come. Very good. So we can take that one that we have and use it in the offensive. Okay, now we have these guys here that can do the capping. We can decap this, decap this. And just hang around here, I guess. And we had some engineers somewhere. Yes, there's engineers. Okay, nice hands move forward. We got some reinforcements coming. Let's repair the prints. And the machine gunner. And position our mechs just a little bit smarter, maybe. And let's try and take on this stupid cannon tower there. Just march up. I think it was here, no? Up there somewhere. There it is. Okay. Eisenhans, go. And the engineers can then just hang out in their shrapnel pillbox. And we're gonna actually upgrade this because we are rich and filthy rich at that. And you guys just come here. Oh, no. we have the prince first. Then go there. Somebody's shooting again. Why is this thing like. What the hell? So sturdy. Can we just kill this? Ouch. You know what, we can do that too. Prince does have some impressive offensive capabilities. Just kill this! Oh, goodness gracious. There we go, finally. Let's go for some... Uh, well, actually, I'll just let the engineers uh, repair at the front until they're out of health, and then we'll, we'll go for... Oops, a new squad. That's the easiest. Apparently, that won't take very long. Oh, let's give the prince some full destruction action. There's some more mortars or whatever they are. Killing my units. And the Eisenhand squad is already killed as well. That's okay. We're gonna replace that. And I misclick again. Sorry, guys. Haha. <laughs> oh, man. Can't play too many games. Get distracted. Okay. Rear armor, huh? Here, have some machine gun fire. Where's that engineer squad, though? There's one Eisenhand squad. One died, I'm pretty sure of that. So, where's my. Why are you not capping this? Here, go for the oil pump. There you go, here, then there. <clears throat> Where is that engineer squad? I don't see it. We have one Eisenhans, we have a second Eisenhans, but we had another engineer squad. And we had room for that. Where did that supply go? Really weird. Okay. Uh, well. Oh, there's another auto gun sentry. Actually, let's kill the barracks there first. Mm -hmm. What? Which unit did we lose? How did we lose a Wotan? Okay. This is so weird. Not a gun sentry here. It's not there. Oh god. I'm doing it again. Who's shooting? Huh. Can't see anybody shooting. We got the 
barracks done now. Uh huh. Sure. Okay, so we got these guys done. Uh, I think we want to retreat a little bit because we're almost dead with everybody here. Um, don't know how much we can expect in the form of defense, but I mean, better be safe than sorry, right? We can bring forward the Eisenhand squad there and uh, maybe the Wotan. Just go here. But these two they want to be somewhere where we can defend. I'm bring you as well. Where are those engineers, man? I really would love to know. Yeah, we really don't have them. Got a second Eisenhans. Got a second Wotan. I guess we're good. Yeah, I guess we're good with that kind of firepower. Let's just bring the uh, Wotans in position. Um, bring Eisenhans behind them. And uh, yeah, we'll just accept that we're gonna lose a mech or two, no problem. Just don't lose the Prince so easily. Mm, might as well bring my experienced engineers, but I'm not sure what events are gonna trigger because they keep reminding us we shouldn't be doing this we shouldn't be doing this your father won't be happy um that wasn't the orders blah blah so might be we're getting a weird who's shooting who the hell is shooting i'll just walk in there and offer one of my units want to know who's shooting at me. Nice and hands forward. Is that mines that we have there? No, it's just an advanced workshop. Yeah, maybe we'll just walk into some mines. I mean, it's the only explanation I have by now. So we'll just keep advancing and uh, walk into their trap. That's the best idea I have currently. We could cap all these maps, uh, all these these uh, iron mines and, and oil pumps and whatnot, but I don't think it's really worth it. Just a bit of a waste of time. Let's get that advanced workshop. Ah, there's the headquarters up here. Interesting. Okay, probably they have some stuff here as well. Ah, uh, maybe that is the base. Okay, maybe that is the base that we want to attack. I don't know. I really don't know. I wonder if there's a way you can actually see these mines. Um, and uh, get rid of them. That would be nice. What would be even nicer by now is to have a squad of engineers. You know what we can do? We can uh, de-commission these guys, yeah. We are now. And uh, have the machine gunners hang around here. And then we bring this squad of engineers, because I'm really, really paranoid. I mean, this mission is already the longest mission on Earth. I don't want to be surprised anymore. So we're just going to bring these guys and repair the two mechs. And of course, keep destroying the base. I mean, that much is obvious. We are here to decimate. Very good. Okay. Now we got one less supply. Really weird. Because of the cannon? Like, if you man the cannon, that costs you one supply? Some of the rules of this game are not properly explained to me, I feel. There's a squad of engineers. Let's test it. If we man the cannon, is that going to be plus one supply? It indeed is. Okay, interesting. But we did the mission anyway. Well done, man. Sir, look at this. What is it? Chlorine gas. 
Enough to cover this whole area in a deadly fog. Ooh. Those monsters wanted to suffocate us in our own trenches. Well, we don't know that for sure. They would have done it. They have no honor. Let's give these vermin a taste of their own medicine and purge them from the earth. Sir, what are you saying? Follow me. He's a bit excitable, that prince. And this mission goes on. <laughs> really? <laughs> Don't tell me it goes on. Don't tell me it goes on. Please don't. I mean, it was already... What did we use? Like three episodes? Oh, no. Okay. There's a cutscene in between. Bearer of the Iron Cross and Oberst. If things go on like this, you'll be giving me orders soon. I serve my people however I can. You think you serve your people by disobeying orders and letting hundreds of Rosmiets die in agony? The fortress had been under siege for months. The Knights of Saxony succeeded in only hours. The way east is clear now. Poison gas, Wilhelm. Never before have we waged war like this. We've never lost millions of our people either. There are villages in Saxony where you can't find a man between 15 and 35 anymore. Families losing their sons and brothers and fathers. Villages destroyed, cities burning. Have you seen the man in the fortress? Have you seen the look on their faces? It was horrible. But shouldn't every means be justified, even our duty? As long as it alleviates the suffering of the Saxonian people? Problem is, this is exactly what some Rosviet commander in his trench thinks too. Now you have given him license to make everything in the war far worse. Oh man, yeah. This is what war is. Easy to get in, and it gets worse and worse. It has to be done now. They could be everywhere. Dissolve the Reichstag. Dismiss your advisors and bring the press under your control. You need absolute power That's to... That's all for now, Ken. Now that is a beard. So we're having chats with crazy old men now, instead of saving the Reich? That is all. Who gave him the black eye? Old friend, good to see you. Have a seat. Olga Morozova, confidant of my cousin, Tsar Nicholas. It's an honor to meet the great Gunther von Duisburg. Why am I here? Scheming politicians talk of abolishing the monarchy. Impertinent industrialists threaten to stop funding the crown. And you, <laughs> you ask why you are here? I can hold back the tide. What if you could? A few months ago, myself, Tsar Nicholas, and other leaders received information about a secret organization. Men who have promoted the war, prolonged it, used it to gain power. The information came from Nikola Tesla. He has been collecting intel about this organization for years. They call themselves Fenris. The accusations were as outrageous as they were credible. Tsar Nicholas and I have agreed to a ceasefire through secret channels in an effort to expose Fenris members in our governments. That's why you're here. I need someone I can trust. You publicly called me a liar to save your son. There are elements in Dresden. I suspect even among my ministers who work against me and the ceasefire. A liar! The people are unhappy. Our propaganda is not even that disturbed. We were on the verge of victory. They do not understand why we've embraced our Rusviet brothers. We think Fenris wants to use that to their advantage. According to Olga, they are working to reignite the war. No shadowy organization made Sars and Kaiser start this war. It was their own stupidity. Their dream of power and glory. Hubris. Enough. And now you're looking for any other possible explanation. 
because your failure is so colossal that no man could admit it without going mad. You are out of line. I can assure you Fenris is real. I have observed the meeting of Fenris leaders with my own eyes. Of course you have. Espionage and uh, manipulation are not my battlefields, Fräulein. I am a soldier, have been all my life. Unfortunately, there is nothing left worth fighting for. Do I have to order you to help me? Try it. <laughs> well, okay. Somebody's a bit angry. Uh, I hope that doesn't mean we're going rogue with three units again and can't build a base. Please let me do a base building in the next mission. Hmm. All right, Mena. This is our target. A village of immense strategic importance north of us. Capturing it will finally break the enemies back in this region. <clears throat> Unless something changed since this morning, I am the commanding officer here. This is my operation. Without my knights and I, your men would still be in a stalemate a hundred kilometers west of here. And you have been promoted for your bravery, but you are not my superior. Headquarters identified this village as having crucial strategic importance. There are strong enemy fortifications on the west side of the river. That's why the Knights of Saxony will advance on the east side and take the village before noon. We have to clear the western shores. There are two bases, here and here. As soon as we destroy them, this strongly fortified line becomes our main objective. Sure, do that. We'll take the village in the meantime. It's unwise to push too far without backup. You could be surrounded mm -hmm. by the enemy. That's correct that you sides. will be surrounded. Of course. Let's yeah, let's work. please get to work. Conquer the two bases. All right. So he's going to be uh, doing his own thing. Um, do we have engineers? Oh, we do have engineers. Conquer the bases. What does that mean, conquer the bases? We'll have to... Okay. Can we build a base? Yeah, we could build one. Uh, where could we do that? Cake. Nowhere here, apparently. Huh, okay, that is not so great. Right away. Let's the go forward. And we got the iron mine there. Uh, so I think we'll just try and. Yeah, 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 yeah. How are we gonna be smart about it? Well. First of all, we're not going to use our troops. Um, second of all, we're going to put some anti-armor gunners in here. And third of all, we're going to use your artillery strike to kill this here. There we go. Nicely done. And now we should have easy pickings. What's the prince doing there? Just marching, marching, marching. He's already almost dead, actually. And just bring Eisenhans forward. Slow and steady wins the race. Go, suppression fire. That's a new uh, thing of the patch, by the way, that anybody use suppression fire has that little... Um, that little exclamation mark. No, 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 don't kill the engineers. We desperately need the engineers. I do want to build a base somewhere. Can't build it here, right? Okay. There's some uh, artillery. The Kaiser requires you to take out the enemy artillery, please. Broadside. Let's bring the flamers forward. Uh, well, actually, 
Let's try not to repair Brunhilde if it's not absolutely necessary. Mm -hmm. Time to move. Now let's bring you forward. He has a little bit of a Bane feel to him, doesn't he? <laughs> From the Batman movies. Trying to move. So you think darkness is your ally. You merely adopted the dark. I was... No! Oh, that was close. I almost changed my engineers to something else. Um... Well, let's do this and uh, bring Eisenhans in the middle here. I'll uh, use the enemies for this. Mm, we did have some useless troops somewhere. Um, I think. Oh, let's just take the engineers and take the oil pump. No. We are here to serve. I'm gonna do this. Can we walk up here? Let's just try. I, mean, I don't know who's slower between these two. There we go. Let's grab this and let's see if we can't build a base. Yes, we can build a base here. Um, we can go from here and here, so I think we'll just build the headquarters somewhere in that corner here. Maybe like so. And then get the oil pump with the flamers. Actually with these guys. Um, let's put the flamers here and these guys here. Ouch! No, 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 we need you here. Let's get out of the cannon range. There we go. Oh, God. Um, do we anything to artillery strike? Not really. How about you just take that all apart? That would be lovely. And how about you repair this? That would be even lovelier. Ouch, 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 ouch. They have quite a lot of firepower. It's okay though, we can uh, repair our mech. Um, and actually, now that we don't have to worry about that cannon anymore, we should be alright. There we go. There we go. Okay, let's get these guys out. And uh, let's. Ah, oh, that stupid prince is already so far ahead. Pair Brunhilde a little bit and position her like so. Let's bring the guys forward like so. And in the meantime, we can re-establish a base. I mean, we definitely need a bit more income there. Well, actually, you know what? Let's do the let's have the eyes and hands do the honors. There we go. And then they can run just into my machine gun fire. That's what I like. Okay, the engineers can now go ahead and build ourselves a bit of a barracks, maybe over yonder. I'm hoping this is the way we we wanted to set it up. I hope we don't need to rush with that stupid prince there. He will, uh, he will most likely die anyway. Alrighty. And, but before we take that base, guys, uh, we're going to take a little cut in here. Because I'm really, really tired, as you could probably tell by this episode. And I think we have a good point to cut it. So, uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one. And uh, see you around for the next episode.